drop it. What's going on, guys? Heatings here, back with another Nice and Dragons video for you. And today I have a very, very, very special episode for you guys. So, um, as you guys know, I usually don't borrow accounts, but uh, my buddy Corbin Brand from the Vice Tone Savages, a uh, now the Republic Guild, came up to me. Was like, hey, you know, I got you want to do a video with my account? So of course I said yes. Here are his knights. He's got Hellfire. He's got Runic Robes, Revelation Robes, uh, Soul Vanguard. Got the Stalwart Vanguard. Got tons of War Epics. Uh, he's a gem spender. As you can see, I'll go ahead and I'll scroll through the other ones that he has too. So, you know, he has tons of Epics here, guys. And these aren't even his max ones. I'll show you guys his max ones here in a minute. But, you know, just scrolling through real quick, he's got like two or three forge stones he's got that guardians war gear which i'm going to go ahead and actually power level at the end of this video he ran top 10 with majestic so uh in that war so that's pretty awesome i'm pretty excited to go ahead and power level that uh that should be towards the end of this episode but here are his max epics he got tons of war epics i mean he's got the cyclone chain mail uh that looks like Bronze Chromatic, he's got uh, the Curseman Shroud, he's got tons of them, guys, so, I mean, he's been around for a while, and like I said, he's he's a gem spender, he, he gets it done, so, uh, <clears throat> like I said, I'm going to be popping open some Dark Prince keys, Enchanted Chest, um, some Silver Chest, stuff like that, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the guild real quick, though, Vice Tone Savages, so, they were a top 10 guild for the Arclight, Shroud War, so that was the War of the Austria. Uh, you know, they took seventh, so really great job. Uh, so here we go. I'm going to go ahead and start popping these chests. Uh, like I said, it's got tons of them. It may take a few minutes. I'm actually going to keep a gem and fusion boost counter going for you guys, so that should be pretty interesting to see how many he ends up with. But yeah, guys, see you in a little bit.
like you'll never forget the way it's got to be It's nobody's concern cause they don't know how it burns when you're not here with me
Sometimes it's like you never forget the way it's got to be It's nobody's concern cause they don't know how it burns when you're not here with me
so that should do it. Level 99 Guardians War Gear, 782 attack, 2070 defense, and it's an absolute monster. It's better than Sandstorm Plus uh, by like 50 combined stats. So I'm gonna go ahead and show it the or show you guys that is the female and the male version of this final evolution. I'm gonna show you the stats. Obviously, right here equipped on Main Knight. It's a 2644 attack, 3008 defense. So that's absolutely insane. Uh, the stats on it are ridiculously good. So there's the male version. There's female. Um, you know, not really much of a state change, just a little bit smaller stature as usual. But yeah, guys, so this is an absolutely sick, sick armor. I would love to have this armor. I didn't see, you know, 50 combined stats really being worth it, but, you know, obviously, if somebody didn't have a good earth armor or a good wind armor or air armor, whatever you prefer to call it, this would have been the war to go for because, I mean, I like the way that this armor looks and it's absolutely insane when it comes to stats, so I'm going to go ahead and equip this Hellfire back on already to his main knight and I'm just gonna go ahead and throw the guardians onto his uh, air slash wind knight whatever you call it and uh, even on the secondary knight it's 25 2545 attack and 2908 defense so still really good stats guys I mean the defense is only a hundred points from being on the main knight so um, yeah, guys, so I really want to thank Corwin for allowing me to make this video. Obviously, it would have been possible without le him letting me make this video. Uh, so, yeah, thanks to him. But, yeah, guys, until next time, this is T-Dunks signing off.